there was a licensing op, which very basic overview of what that means is that like when you take a TV show, a video game, or any kind of commercial opportunity, they'll reach out to a what's called a publishing company. That publishing company then reaches out to artists or their managers to tell them, hey, this is what this company is looking for, this is the sound they're looking for, this is the genre of music they're looking for. Um, this is the uh, the price that they're willing to pay for the music if they if they you know if they choose yours. Um, and this is the, the deadline. The deadline is by today, and it's actually uh, ASAP. So I'm gonna really try to bang out the whole writing and recording of a track in one sitting, and then also mix and master it, and then get it out to them in hopes that I still have it, I'm still within the deadline. So uh, I'm just documenting that process and you will see what this looks like. So I'm gonna try to get to it. The guy that produced this, uh, his name is Icy. He is very, very young, and he smashed this out with, within literally like an hour and a half this morning. Uh, trying to help me out with this whole deadline thing, so he's, he's dope. I've been feeling like I'm um, so, a lot of what I do is the writing process, especially for right now, because I have no idea the words I'm going to be putting to this song. Like, I'll have words that randomly come to mind like one of the first um words that i thought of was, was beast and there's supposed to be a motivational feel to it like a hopeful like a comeback type of vibe to the track so that's kind of like where i'm leading with and so anyways the words that come to mind right now is beast uh, but the main thing that i try to do before i even know the words is i'll figure out the melody line so i'll be like I'll, I'll literally just be sounding like a complete idiot going like ah, no, 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 no. just you know just I remember like I'll just, like just say random words that make no sense I'll make random noises that make no sense just trying to find the melody so uh yeah I see the producer he's already all paid out I already bought the beat from him um so he's all good what I'm gonna do now is download that beat the file that he sent me um and then I'm gonna drop that into my software, which is called Reason. It's the same software I've used since I was probably um, like 17 or something. So anyway, I'm gonna drag the beat into Reason. BPM is 70. BPM, that means beats per minute. And what that basically means is it just helps you structure the song and makes it much easier to work. Um, throughout the whole session as far as applying effects and just moving vocals around and just everything like that. So that's like the very first thing you do. If you don't already know the BPM, you just gotta figure it out real quick. And now it's just the creative process. Right now. I would like to blame it on quarantine, but this door back here, this is where I have my my recording set up and it gets the dopest sound of all time. This is it. I don't have a million dollar studio, nothing like that. It's literally inside my closet with the sound treatment. It's called sound treatment right there. Um, and then I got like my, this is called a pop filter. And then this uh, more of the enclosure there just to kind of isolate the sound a little bit. Better run, they got me feeling like a beast. You better run, so strap the laces on your feet.